you all know me by now. I'm not a big fan of all this trendy fitness shit like uh, the kettlebells, TRX, scientifically backed research, women who are fucking stronger than me. I just don't like all you liberals coming in here trying to change my way of life. So I don't like kettlebells. Same reason all old people are racist. I didn't make the rules. It's just how them geezers are built. Not their fault. What's all this construction stuff behind you, Dom? I'm building the wall. It's just so kettlebells can't come in. I'm gonna make America great again. Take our country back. Call me Donald Pump. Using kettlebells is like underage drinking. You think you look cool doing it, but really, you have no idea what you're doing. Also, like underage drinking, if you're gonna do it, I'd rather you do it under my supervision. And even though I'm not cool with, you know, let's say kids drinking in my basement, I'm still gonna come down there and show you how it's fucking done. Maybe make out with your girlfriend. I don't know. I've had a lot of blow. It's gonna be a long night. Anything could happen. Come down there and take a celebrity shot. Take a celebrity shot at your girlfriend. <laughs> okay, let's start with a brief, a brief explanation of why kettlebells are bullshit which will make up approximately 85% of this video and 100% of the truth. Derek Pose, what? Kettlebells are outdated technology. They are the first edition of weights. That shit's been around since fucking Gilgamesh. You trying to tell me this, this is some new shit? Some better stuff? Fucking save it. There's a reason why gyms are now filled with barbells and dumbbells and not stones and logs and sacks of grain. It's because dumbbells and barbells work better and we have evolved as a species. That is, until the hipster came along, the same guy who's trying to convince me that his beat ass record player, phonograph over here, plays better sound than my space age music pill. Which, by the way, was invented by a doctor. You're not even trying to reinvent the wheel with this. You're just using the old fucking wheel again. While, while I'm venting here, as if reading wasn't hard enough, I gotta fumble around to try to find the tiny number etched into this grainy, rusted, pitch black iron ball sack just to decipher what kettlebell I'm using. Really expect me to be able to read that? I mean, should I grab a piece of carbon paper and some charcoal and excavate it like an artifact? And no one even attempts to re-rack the kettlebells properly. I gotta get down on all fours and dig through this pile of rubble just to find the matching weight. I gotta get Balto the fucking rescue dog. I gotta use my, my special Balto whistle. I only gotta use it once to get Balto over here to sniff out the matching kettlebell, which doesn't exist, because why would you ever need two kettlebells? You don't even need one. That's what dumbbells are for. <sighs> it's not just about what kettlebells are. It's about what they're used for. Goofy ass, Functional exercises. According to my research on uh, that there Wikipedia, kettlebells are used to mimic real world activities such as shoveling and farm work. So let me get this straight. You're spending 200 bucks a month at Equinox so you can get better at poor people work? That's like when Gwyneth Paltrow tried to live off of food stamps for a week. Buys like a head of lettuce, 10 limes. It's all cool to do, unless you gotta actually shovel for a living, or you need food stamps to actually live. Then all of a sudden, it's not so cool. Uh, me, I'm a functional guy, all right? I need bench press so I can push the haters out the way. I need curls so I can get better at pointing at myself. This guy right here. This guy. If that wasn't enough to convince you to stick to dumbbells. Here are some suggested kettlebell exercises. And yes, they are exactly what you think they're gonna be. <sighs> Let's get this one out of the way. Bicep curls. These are great for isolation. And when you want to take someone's kettlebell so they can't use it for dumb shit. Like literally anything else. Ugh. Shrugs. So you don't have to bend down as far to pick up the weight. Hey, uh, call me Shreddy Wop. Uh, I'm a trap king. I'm a trap king. Uh. Single arm tricep extensions. It's easier to hold than trying to balance a dumbbell on your palm like you're a cocktail waitress. 
lateral raises. Use kettlebells instead of dumbbells to give you better engagement on your delts. The weight is below your hands. Similar to pointing your thumbs down while you're doing lateral raises with dumbbells. Tip, use dumbbells instead and just point your fucking thumbs down. Use it as a doorstop. Not even that good for that. Dumbbells would probably be better. I mean, this will probably work. Get some sweet Gucci action. Ooh, yeah. Dress it up like a man so your boss thinks you're still at work. My arms are bigger IRL though. Arms not shown to scale. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Uh, I'm working on the next weekly video as we speak. You'd see me winking, but I'm a kettlebell. Uh, while we're talking about playing dress up, if you wanted to dress up like a real man for Halloween, you could dress up like D-Man. Dom, me. Not the kettlebell version, but the flesh version. Go to DomMerch.com to swag my special Halloween package, including all these things over here, including everything you see there for money.